everyone, this is Janelle with PTO Today, and today I'll be showing you how to make a flyer in Canva. So I'm logged into my free account, and I, when I created my account, I chose the nonprofit option, but you can choose any of their designs and create any graphic using any of their options. So click on to create a design over in the top left, and Canva will give you a lot of different graphic options. And scroll down to marketing materials, and here you'll see a template called flyer. And this will simply give you a sheet of paper that is eight and a half by 11, which is the perfect size to print a flyer. And so Canva will default to showing you a lots of pre-made templates by their designers, and they're all really beautiful. But today I'm gonna to show you how to make one from scratch. And so we're gonna make a flyer for a spring carnival. And so let's click on elements. And what I'd like to do is start off with a fun, brightly colored, photo or artwork for the background. So I'll just search balloons and I definitely want to choose one of their free options here and simply click on it and it'll be added to your canvas. And so I'll extend it so that it's going from edge to edge as I do want the photo background to be almost the same size as the piece of paper. Just keep in mind that a lot of printers have different print margins and so if you do print this out you'll notice that sometimes they'll, some of the edges will be cut off. So before I add some text to this, I do want to add an area to make sure I have some contrast between the text and the photo background. So go back to clicking on elements and click on shapes. And now you can add a white box here, simply and it's centered right here in the middle. And so I'm gonna make this a little bit bigger so I have some more room for my text. Now that looks good but I do want to soften this a little bit and be able to see some of that, some of those balloons in the background. So with that white box selected, click on to the transparency tab on the top right. And this is where you can play with that white box and that transparency. And so I still want it to be fairly opaque so that the text is, has some contrast to the background. So that seems about right to me. So next you click on text over on the left and Canva will show you a lot of different options again. And click any of these that you like and want to play with. What's great about Canvas, Canva is you can always go back and change the fonts even after you've typed in your messages. And so I will make it roughly about the same width as that white box. And then you just double click on each field and start typing. So I'm gonna make this a little bit smaller so it all fits on one line here. Make sure you add the date and the time. And here at PTO Today, we always recommend having free events. So I'm just going to now center this in the white area and we're done. So what I need to do next is in order to print this, just click on download in the top right and make sure you have PDF print option selected. That will give you the highest resolution that Canva can give you for this flyer. And go ahead and click download and this will save and add into your downloads folder. And then you will have a PDF that will be ready for print. And that's it, you've created your first flyer in Canva.